Hello, and welcome to Upload and Download Faster with Direct to S3 Access. My name is Jaime Rosales, and I'm a Senior Developer Advocate for the Forge platform. Just a simple safe harbor slide, but in summary, the current slide makes the statement to please do not make any business decisions about the next talk. We do not guarantee of changes in the future. Let's get started with download files direct from S3. So in today's workflow, we download our files from the object storage service. But in the background, this service makes a request to S3 in order to obtain that file. In this example, we'll be focusing on larger files, files that go over one gigabyte of size to compare the performance to the newer approach. So what are we suggesting now? So a direct download from S3 that will bypass the second layer access and allow us to obtain the files faster. So in recent tests, we saw an improvement on an average of 200% faster downloads for these large files compared to the classic approach of the direct access to the OSS. So in the way that it works is that we request a pre-signed URL in order for us to directly request the download from S3 as it's shown in this diagram. What about now the upload file to direct to S3? So the upload approach requests an S3 signed URL with which to upload an object <clears throat> or an array of signed URLs with which to upload an object in multiple parts. So we see an increase on performance of an average of 50% going directly to S3 when using these larger files. So files that are over a one gigabyte in size. And we expect that the performance actually increases to scale with the file size. So presumably, think about a file that is a 10 gigabyte file will have an even greater improvement. So what are the benefits? Let's look at the download performance. So with the download performance, we get the opportunity of also caching at the edge location. So by doing this, we get the possibility of actually getting repeated download attempts for the same object from the same region. And actually this should be near, nearly instantaneous. So in different regions, like the America region, we get an improvement of 200%, in MIA of 100%, in APAC region of 150%. What about the upload? So from the upload side, we see more consistent performance as well, which this will allow us to be less subject to variation in times. Faster than classic approach, we get in the American region of 50%, EMEA region 50%, and APAC region 50%. And this focusing always in larger files. So when it comes to the API references, what do we have available today? So today you can try the download approach directly from S3. So using the following endpoint, you will get a short-lived sign URL where you can download your files, which will be bypassing the OSS servers. Coming soon, it's the upload approach. So keep an eye on our Forge newsletter and Forge blog to get news about newly released endpoints. And some additional resources for you. We get started with the Forge portal. This is the place where you can obtain documentation, tutorials, and references about the Forge services. We also have tutorials available in Node.js, .NET, Java, PHP, and Go, which you can find more in the learnforge.autodesk.io tutorial. At the same time also, you can book an appointment with the Forge experts with the Doctor is In initiative, where you can find our schedules in the Calendly link posted here. And last but not least, we run accelerators every month. So this is an opportunity for you to get started with your project. So to find the next accelerator near your city, please check out the accelerator program link in the Forge website. Thank you very much and have a good day.